million euro dollars. A hefty price, yes. Good evening, Night City. Bud? Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deets. One Reverend Colbert. Praise be to me, our Father in Heaven. And our second guest is Karina Lee, host of the Chip End program, which promotes the use of cybernetic implants. I love tuning in, beautiful. Complain, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. Now, I'd like to talk about the most exclusive and highly sought after. Get it fixed the last two. Gotta be some kind of scam. We're gonna have a word with this super. Oh, yeah.
think I might have caught something. When I jacked into that corpo's biomon. I know a neurovirus or need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling and my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Yeah, throw some threads, meet me downstairs. Hey V, Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How did you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. NCPD! Open up! Go to hell! Huh. Like my new punching bag. This gave me a next gen ass whooping. He did. Be curious to see how he handles the likes of me. <laughs> so, how about it? How's it going? Fight's about to start. Not gonna watch? Take notes? Just to go. Malone versus Hernandez? <laughs> nah. Our chrome don't friend worry. here don't watch TV. Don't talk neither. Only way he communicates with them this. Where'd you get him, Fred? Off the street. Saw him looking up at me with these big, sad eyes. So I took the poor pup in. Fed him, clothed him. <laughs> nah, for real. He's a military bot. Got a sweet deal. And a chum of mine tossed in a few upgrades. Now, here we are. Let's do this. Light on your feet. Keep that head moving.
Not anymore. Skull's taking too much of a beating. Reflexes ain't what they used to be. There's ways of fixing that. Forensic cops should do the trick. I'd rather dish out my eddies for something else. It's time I started taking it easy. You mentioned something about fighting? Mm. I've seen you land in blows in the rain. You've got sharp instinct, good edge. You can go far, especially if you get chipped. These fights, let's just say they aren't legal, but very lucrative. Lucrative for who? You or me? Both of us. I get a small percentage of the total winnings, you know, as your agent. You get the rest. Oh, I get it. Want to get rich off my blood, sweat, and tears. Hey, you gotta make a buck somehow, right? At least I'm giving it to you straight. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you want to go. Put down your eddies and start swinging. When you take home the pot, manage to drop every last one of them, you get a chance to fight in the grand finale. That all clear? Crystal. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. You can start in Kabuki. I believe in you, V. Time to show this city what you're made of. What have you got for sale? Only top shelf gear. After every shot now. Mm -hmm. I, I can't. Let's have a look. Are we cool? Thanks. A and theatrical performances in the no tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation. And in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka announced her participation in the Dashi Parade. From all of us at W. So Didn't figure you as the type for Asian. Would have thought you'd find it too exotic. What do you mean? 
What's there not to like? Noodles? Check. Synth sirloin? Check. Get some more chile action up in here, and you're looking at Mama Well's signature sopa de fideos. <laughs> Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but. Just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated coup. Thought Dex bounced out of the ring a few years ago. Messed with a nasty crew in Pacifica. Things got ugly. Mm -hmm. Gang wars two years back. Somehow Dex got caught up in the craziness. A lot of bodies lying in the streets by the time the shooting stopped. Yeah, Dex got lucky, though. Managed to slip under the radar till tempers cooled. Took a while, but he's made one hell of a comeback. This is it, Jackie. Our break. Dex needs friends, needs us. We can use him. Amen, chica. It's a win-win. How did you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You and me? No. Oh, but t -Buck, she's the one that hooked us up. Got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on, ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? Mr. <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Well, our savior wants to tell you everything himself. Face to face. No pressure, but... Who deals right on you now, chica? Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back. And my face is yesterday's news. All Dex says he needs to check you. Talk to you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice, then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is a of his own. He's in it. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gonk to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias a Dios. Oh, you know. Brought your wheels. Give them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our, uh, dust off with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. First stop, Ripper Dock. Anchica, easy on the gas, eh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vic's anyhow. I got a date. Me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know? out what Dex has cooked up for us. Your memory! For your eyes do not belong to you, or rather, not only to you. Do you truly believe that those who have sold you your mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation to peek through them? 
Cameras are all around us, even within us. Your joys, your worries, your life. For this, let's just say you're right. So what? Should I just gouge out my optics? Nah, thanks, but no thanks. You are beyond salvation, but not the children of the future. Life untainted by surgery of the sacrilege. We can yet save them. May the mothers shield their bodies. May the fathers instill their hatred for Crow. But who are those who follow our every step, you ask? Why, the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri! In their wretchedness, they placate their weary and oppressed uh, masses oh by putting our laughter, our tears, oh on full I display! Oh, get next to him! I'll snap still if you are arresting him for revealing government secrets. Open your mind before it is too late! Jessica will, like, die when she sees this. Like, this is Max Nova. I just can't. Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. You look pleased. Because I am. Spry as ever, you old ripper. Good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Oh, kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Met a new fixer. Gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshawn. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But? Something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex Deshaun. Hitting the major leagues. New tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now, Jack, in. Kuroshi, whoa! Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy, then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this... might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. See what's going on inside.
Mark I, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though? <laughs> really, Doc? Makes you sound like a dentist, always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky gannic hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. Oh, beautiful. For the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. You're the best, Vic. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Now every last fighter's got extra skull lining. Absorb 75% of every blow. Got cash riding on this? Nah, just looking. <laughs> it's out of habit more than anything else. Miss it, don't you? Ah. Uh...
heart chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds, anything red. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. But what they don't... V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyberpsychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. <sighs> what is life without its body? What are the beings of the net if not souls from beyond our plane of existence? I have heard their voices. Let they who yet live You heard never... their voices? What did they say? They spoke not in the language of mortals, no. They howled, screaming in agony, forever removed from their earthly form. Among them was a woman, her voice of ice, Queen Lilith. She was calm, but at the cost of her people. You ask, who opened these unholy gates of the abyss? No one's asking. And I answer you, the techno-necromancers of Alpha Centauri! I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? You do good work. Use this to wake Night City up. Thank you for your devotion. I saw a disciple of truth in you from the very beginning. Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears
Yo, Miss V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Would you rather live in peace as Miss Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory smelling near like posies without seeing your 30th? You're either somebody or you fizzle out into nothing. Night City don't let you choose. Oh, but it does. See, in my line of work, no. I choose no to way. be Mr. Chill. Sorry. But I, folk I who try to take advantage, well, they see the beast inside. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Hang on, got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Bucks in here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you, but we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Hmm. Guessing it belongs to a corp? Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Klein who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Klein. What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho Gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, Convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's words. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Royce guy, what's he like? A straight psychopath. Chrome-loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. Who's a prima donna? Corpo agent. Internal affairs. 
been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip-tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Miss V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally in nine, yeah. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small keys. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot military prototype. Maelstrom clipped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. versus Brick. Hostile takeover. Well, sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent, too, but don't know how much help she stands to be. Huh. Chingon. Nah, she won't be causing any more. Yeah, he don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? Yeah, he's fucking whack, something special. Junky snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table, Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, check chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Parker. Think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. What I lay. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Stick around. Hasta luego.